and welcome to our how to sessions in this session we'll learn more about domain whitelisting with domain whitelisting feature of gcontrol you can restrict users from accessing other google apps domain from your organizational network you can add domains to be allowed and the domains which are not specified as allowed domains will be blocked to configure domain whitelisting feature log in into your google apps admin console click on apps followed by more apps and then on g control icon you will be automatically redirected to the g control dashboard go to the left pane and click on category control click on domain whitelisting feature to create policy click on add policy button you will be redirected to the policy page give a title and description for your policy to enable the policy check enabled you can disable the policy by unchecking the same checkbox to keep the policy valid all the time check valid always option to keep the policy enabled for a specific duration define to and from dates specify the message to be displayed in case of violation of policy in the given text box to add allowed domain names to the policy click add domain button you can add multiple domain names by uploading a csv file by clicking on import csv button as it is shown select the type of policy note that the policy type once selected cannot be changed in case of user based policy click on add user button to add users to the policy in case of multiple users click on upload a csv file by clicking import csv button in case you want to add all domain names to the same policy check this box in case of ou based policy select the organizational unit that is to be added to the policy to add ip addresses to the policy click on add ip address button in case of multiple ip addresses you can upload a csv file by clicking on import csv button in case you want to restrict users from all ip addresses to the same policy check this checkbox select person to be notified in case of policy violation an email regarding violation will be sent to the selected person in such instances click on save to save the policy thank you for your time looking forward to meeting you in our next session